Hello, this is Kevin with Blue Fox Engineering. Today I'm going to be going over uh, two different options for the effluent line going out of your septic tank. Um, what I have here is a, a really a standard effluent T that would come out of a primary treatment tank in a um, a secondary treatment system. This would, would still be used. This keeps fats, oils, and greases from going into your uh, soil absorption system or into your secondary tank. The, this line, this 4-inch PVC line, would be passing through the tank wall and the tank level should come up just to the bottom, what's often called the invert of that pipe. So scum is scum, trash, grease, Anything that floats that's big that you don't want going into your soil absorption system is stopped by this. And then it gets down, um, this is about 18 inches, and um, it would keep, uh, keep that scum off and let it draw from a more clear layer below. So this is a minimum standard for, for what's expected. A little bit of an upgrade is an effluent filter, and this is a product made by Polylock, uh, the local uh, plumbing supply house that sells uh, septic, uh, septic products and all kinds of water products. They do everything from municipal uh, water supply stuff, fire hydrants, to septic drain field products. They stock this. Uh, this unit retails for a little over 100 bucks, and it's made. This one's made by Polylock. There are other manufacturers out there, but it forces anything that's larger than the little slits in this cartridge can't pass through. This, the cartridge slides down into this T, which keeps similar to the standard T, keeps uh, fats, oils, and greases out. This one has a red ball at the bottom so that supposedly when you pull the cartridge out, it doesn't let any flow through. I haven't found that these work particularly well. They don't seem to seal that great. There is some additional maintenance necessary. If you have one of these, you do need to clean it uh, for a residential system inspection every month would be great at a minimum every three months uh, pull it out rinse it off with a garden hose make sure that it's still flowing well um, but this is just good insurance uh, it's a good practice it's a an upgrade that I think is well worth it on any system to protect your either your secondary tank or your uh, soil absorption system